Welcome to Tonight with Cassidy on what I want to start calling Weird Wednesday. Weird Wednesday. I yeah, like it. when we can get our amazing resident weird expert, aka Chief Meteorologist Matt Safino. You know, that's like the, if you had a business card that had what I want your title to be, it'd say resident weird expert, and then in a little font, like. Make some for me. I'll hand them out. Why not? Sure. So we do it. this whole segment. That is so Portland mm -hmm. where people send us all the weird, crazy, unique, cool things Fun, that you can only, yeah, mm -hmm. only see in Portland. And people are sending, you, you guys are really stepping up. Yeah. You're sending some great material, so keep them coming. We'll do it again next week. I know. We got to have you back every week because people keep sending stuff. Things keep it. happening. All right, so what let's we get start into with? it. We're going to start with one I think that you found. I did. This that was just sent so in to Portland. me today, and I love this little story here. Janet Dernbach saying, <laughs> hey, I marched in the Grand Floral Parade, and it was pouring rain in the Marshall High School band, and she has to say that it was sunny other years, and that was much more fun. So oh. she's saying this because the forecast for the Grand Floral right. Parade is not I know. Great. I wasn't going to mention at the beginning yeah. that you're in you know, a little trouble for little not yeah. forecasting sunshine, for so that's why up. we're giving you another role on KGW talking about weird things. I can't <laughs> wait to see your your contribution to the Grand Floral yes. Parade. So do you have the do you have the wave down? Can you do a parade wave? Oh, I could totally do the wave. I haven't nice. been invited to do the princess well, thing. Well, uh, yes, but, you um, have. I just invited you. Oh, yes. Thank you. As long as <laughs> you the resident weird expert says so. What about a march? Can you march? Can you do a parade I can march? I can march. I can't play any instruments, but um, we can do that. Multi-talented. Yeah. Well, let's see um, something else talented. A sheep in a Subaru. In a diaper. With a diaper? Yeah, you know, because you just spot that on yeah, the streets of Portland. Yeah, because you don't want any dingleberries in your Subaru. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> what? Oh. Well, that's why the diaper's there. Does Am I the, right? Does the seatbelt work on a, a sheep belt? I, sheep belt? I, I wouldn't know. <laughs> yeah. And now someone sent us this one as soon as our show ended last time we utility had you on. Utility worker scarecrow. Yeah. Look at this. It looks like a utility worker. That's kind and of brilliant. And you get close. It's a scarecrow, but you wouldn't go, you wouldn't want to mess with there because you'd think someone's watching. No, you, right? and you know, just be nice to those people working on the roads. They're in a dangerous situation. So exactly. scarecrow or not, that's that's kind of brilliant. I love that. It is very Portland, isn't it? Yeah. Behave well even if there's not a, an a actual person or a scarecrow watching what is that? you. Now imagine if you're going shopping at the mall. You're hitting up Lloyd Center. And then you see a Tyrannosaurus Rex ice skating. You know, on the ice skating. I rink. could have contributed to our segment <laughs> myself because on Monday. Do you have one of those suits? I was wearing one on Monday. What? Yeah, it was my son's birthday. I wore a T Rex. Was this you undercover? That was not. I can't skate that well. Uncle Dave wore a Godzilla. And we fought it out, and we went into the, the the ballroom where you can, you know, the kids can throw balls at, yeah. at the at PDX Playdate, <laughs> and it was like Lord of the Flies. I mean, they were taking us down. It was vicious. Oh my gosh! So I was gosh. wearing the T Rex myself, but nobody shot video. Maybe what? Okay. I, well, I'll try to Huge do some mistake. up for next week. It needs to be another birthday party. Yeah, right. if you have any, or we could just go shoot a segment where we like <laughs> fight in those or something. Why not? Let's do that. <laughs> Would you want to be Godzilla or T Rex? Ooh. I might need Godzilla else. to like be scarier or something. All right, I, I defer. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. You can vote. Tell us what we should be. Okay, how about this one? If you look closely, there's a chicken that the Portland Police Officer Trummer found this free roaming chicken at Southwest, Southeast 13th and Stark. We're taking you in. Right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and couldn't find the owner, so we tur turned the chicken over to Animal Control and Chicken's Troutdale, feeling the which heat. Is the right thing to do. However, we could use a resident chicken mascot. For the show, right? Really? You think yeah. that'd be fun. Kind of, right? uh, he would have a tough, tough time on this, you know, smooth floor that we have in here. If you won't do but, the T Rex mascot and like be here every day, we oh, can I'll have do it. I'll do that. <laughs> I'll do it if you'll do it. Perfect. I feel Great. a segment yeah, coming every on. Day. Yeah, yeah right? not every day. <laughs> so if you want to send us, of course, you can tweet us at Cassidy Tonight, at Cassidy Quinn with the hashtag Tonight with Cassidy, or, or just at use Safino, you know. at Safino. That's know, a super I'm easy one. Second fiddle here, but you no, can, at you can Safino. also tweet me. He'll watch all of them. And uh, the hashtag, that is so Portland. Or keep Portland weird. We're following all the Both. weird ones. Both. It's all good. Yes. yes. All right. Fun times. Well, thank you. Yep. Resident weird we'll expert, Matt Safino. He's going to get that T-Rex costume. He'll be back. <laughs>